Wuhan three towns make the trip to Hanoi determined to keep their round of 16 hopes alive in Group J, which were boosted by Urawa Red Diamonds losing to Pohang Steelers. Hanoi have suffered defeat in all three matches so far. The hosts lost the reverse match by two goals to one. Tage was sent off early in that match and is suspended, as is Dao Van Nam. Pam Tuan Hai got their goal back at the end and starts here. Wei Shai Hao and Markel scored for Wuhan Three Towns, the latter again starting on the bench. Wuhan Three Towns with an expansive start as Yakubu feeds He Chao and he finishes the chance. That's 1 0 already to the home team in the 10th minute. And the Chinese continue to roar forward. Davidson to Yakubu, but it's stopped by Bing Tao Trong in the Vietnamese goal. Yakubu wrecking havoc at the moment for the Hanoi defence. 29th minute as we see the ball played up towards Wei Shai Hao runs into the box it's a curling effort towards the far post and unlucky to see it just drift wide he does so well here using the defender to shield the keeper's view 37th minute and a free kick here for Hanoi it is taken short and deflected on its way through Li Van Zwan so close to grabbing the equaliser here. Wuhan Free Town still the better side coming towards half time. Hanoi just struggling to clear the corner. As Jiang Zipong, it's a wonderful ball across, and Yakubu slides it wide at the far post. The big striker will be really disappointed with himself. Half time 1 0 to Wuhan Free Towns. They're doing the business so far, but Hanoi remain dangerous. And so it remains coming up towards an hour. As Pam Tuan Hai controls it and it's taken off his toes by Nguyen Duk An. And he just rifles wide. Tremendous strike. 71st minute, it's tense here as Hanoi put a long ball forward and somehow that header has looped over the keeper. Pam Tuan Hai with a superb finish from outside the box and fantastic celebrations for the leveller. 74th minute as Wuhan Free Towns are getting frustrated now where Shai Hao wrestles for the ball and he kicks at it his opponent. Let's look at the replay. I think the referee has no option but to send off the striker. And Hanoi now surely sense they can get their first victory. Noyan Van Tung goes for glory, but the keeper claims it easily. Trying his luck from long range. And still Hanoi push on. The pass here. And that's a terrific turn. Pam Tuan Hai! And he's got the winner in the last minute, surely. It's a really cool finish given the circumstances. He gets his second goal of the game. And that must be the three points for Hanoi. Indeed, it is a full-time 2-1. A magnificent win for Hanoi as they claim their first victory in the group. Pohang Steelers have already qualified, so now a lot rests on Wuhan Free Towns' next match at Urawa Red Diamonds with both sides on four points. Hanoi, on the other hand, will look for a shock victory at Pohang Steelers.